Okay, this is worksheet 10.3, and we're graphing polynomials. So in number one and two, we're given an equation, and we're told that the ground can be represented by the x-axis. The equation represents a new roller coaster's track. So the first thing we're going to do is sketch a graph of the roller coaster's path on this axis. The first thing we want to do is write down where the roots of the polynomial are. Each of these factors gives us a root. This gives us a root at x equals 0. This x minus 4 gives us a root at x equals 4. The x minus 2 gives us a root at 2. And x plus 3 gives us a root at negative 3. We also need to make sure we know the behavior at each of these roots. These 0 and 4 and negative 3 are all to the first power and so those will all be going through so this is going through as well as the roots at 2 and negative 3. The root at 2 or sorry this should be 4 and negative 3 but at 2 we have a squared that means that this root will have a bounce. So let's go ahead and plot our x-intercepts, so 0, 4, 2, and negative 3. And I'm going to start graphing on the right side here. This is the end of the graph. The coefficient in the front of the equation is negative, which tells me that the graph is going to be negative on this side, on the right side. If we start there, at 4 and 0 and negative 3, I'm going through. So at 4, I'm going to go through. At 2, I have a bounce. So when I get to 2, I'm going to bounce up instead of going through. At 0, I'm also going to go through. And at negative 3, I'm also going to go through. So our graph would look something like that. In what interval on the x-axis is the roller coaster above ground? When we look at this x-axis, the roller coaster is above ground between 0 and 4. So I'm going to say x is between 0 and 4. And it's also above ground when x is less than negative 3.